Hey guys, uh, just want to take a look at games here. Now, the other day, uh, we had a, what was supposed to be a $200 million hack, uh, reduced, as I saw in this headline, uh, to about $21 million in damage. Um, so, I don't know, it says they fought back, I don't know how they fought back, I didn't really read this article. Um, but anyways, guys, uh, if you want, you can probably search for this headline. Uh, all I want to do, though, is just uh, take a look at the, uh, you know, charts for Gala. And uh, you can see this on the weekly time frame here. Um, still basically in the accumulation range. And um, basically, you know, if we look at the time frame, I'm going to put some resistances here. And <clears throat> I believe there's going to be a resistance around... Well, probably here at about 4.9, 4.8 cents. Let's just say if you can clear this at 5 cents, it'll be better. Now, after that, there's going to be another probably resistance right around uh, this point at about 7.2 cents. Uh, you can see there was some volume here, some resistance and supports and things. <clears throat> and then uh, it starts to get a little bit easier to climb the ladder. Uh, I'm going to put one here at about 11 and a half cents because of this uh, little range here of, of, I don't know, about eight, nine weeks. And basically after that, I mean, there wasn't much volume up above this, you know, but there was a ton of volume down here where I'm looking at the moment. Uh, let's take a look at this on the daily. Um, now let me move this chart up. Yeah, guys, you can see it's kind of fighting with this a little bit where I put this line, uh, this kind of weekly resistance. And, uh, yeah, it also fought with this line a little bit, as you can see, um, as well, uh, in April and, and March uh, a little bit. So anyways, uh, let's take a quick look at Bitcoin. Now, Bitcoin since yesterday has been falling and uh, <clears throat> not much has happened to my altcoins. Um, I can say that from this point yesterday, I'm still up a little bit, but Bitcoin has fallen back uh, about $2,000 and I kind of expected a little bit more of a pullback, but that's not the case. And uh, anyways, we'll see, maybe this was kind of a, a low right here um, you know, we're kind of getting a, a little bit of a bounce maybe since, you know, uh, last night or so. Um, yeah, so we'll see what happens today. Uh, I'm not sure when the Ethereum, um, you know, ETFs are supposed to be approved. Uh, maybe like tomorrow or Friday or something. So uh, we'll see what happens with that if, if it's approved. Uh, you know, may dump like Bitcoin did, but, you know, that would bring the market down too. It would also bring Bitcoin and altcoins down. But anyways, I don't think we need to really worry about that. Uh, as we saw, Bitcoin bounced uh, significantly back to the upside uh, after dumping 10,000 on that news uh, back in January, I believe it was. So anyways, guys, uh, Bitcoin... Still, you know, not looking too bad. Just needs to break this 71.4 resistance, basically. And uh, then it's back off to the races towards all-time highs. Uh, anyways, guys, yeah, that's what, you know, Gala looks like. And actually, let me let me draw one more resistance line, maybe. Maybe there's a kind of a downward trend here. Okay, it looks like, <clears throat> yeah, it looks like it's just really broken it. Uh, as of a few days ago. So yeah, I just wanted to see if that matched up with anything, but you can see it kind of rode along and then boom, retest, uh, almost a retest there. It's like very, very close, uh, but now it's you know going up. So I don't believe there's anything to worry about with Gala Games, uh, this hack or whatever. Um, I do believe Gala will still do well, may not do as well as it should have now after this and, and the lawsuits 
uh, but we'll see. Anyways, guys, that's all I really got now, and uh, thanks a lot. If you like this video, like, subscribe, activate the bell, and I'll see you guys in the next one.